Katie Masarwe. And I'm Dominique Clark with the Mirador Weekly News. Last Saturday night, students gathered right here in the traffic circle with their fanciest dresses and nicest tux. You guessed it, we're talking about junior prom. For many, J-Prom is among the most memorable experiences of high school. And this year, it was no exception. This year's theme was Atlantis, the Lost Kingdom. Students enjoyed a night of pictures, food, and dancing. Let's take a look. We're here with junior class president Betsy Fellner to get the scoop on prom. What kind of organization on your end and um, other leadership and parent volunteers went into putting on prom? Um, we had to, me and the other junior class officers, had to talk to the DJ to make sure he played like what we wanted. Um, we got to taste the food. Um, we had to design uh, decorations, design invitations and posters, and promote the event. Um, where did prom actually take place? It was at the Oakland Rotunda. Um, what kind of activities was there at prom? Uh, besides dancing, which a lot of kids like to do, there was um, poker, and there were prizes for like first, second, third uh, winners, and there was a photo booth. Um, there was a chocolate fountain, so that was really yummy. Would you say that overall prom went pretty successfully? Yes, there was a little slip up. The food was a little late, but it was still really good. And other than that, prom went really smoothly. Um, often events like this sort of unify your class. How do you think the juniors took this event? Um, our class has been known for um, kind of being not very unified and um, so I think this event like really brought us all together and I think class of 2015 really had a fun time. We're here with junior Katherine Peterson. Um, what did you think of this year's prom theme? It was um, so cool and they did a really good job with like decorations. Um, what were you, would you say some of the highlights of prom were? Um, I think the location was really cool and then also like the decorations and the theme and how they like pulled that all together. Would you say that most people ended up staying with their dates throughout the night or did people sort of mix up and mingle with everyone? Um, I know that like my little friend group like stayed with their dates for the most part but I know like also some people like ditched them. Um, so we're hearing that there was an after party. How did that go? Um, it was super fun. There was a lot of people there and they hired um, bouncers so it didn't get too out of control. Um, but a lot of people like towards the end some people from like the seniors and like other people not from prom showed up. Looks like prom was a night to remember. Prom hasn't been the only thing leadership has been working on. On Wednesday they went to a leadership convention at the Oracle Arena in Oakland. Now we go over to Dominique for more information. We're here with junior Avery Martin to get the scoop on We Day. What exactly is We Day? Um, well, our leadership class got to go to We Day because we raised enough money for the organization Free the Children. So it was like a free concert or like convention for leadership students. How many schools do you think attended We Day? Well, there's 1,600 kids and so I mean, you could do the math on that one. Yeah. Um, what were some of the events that happened at We Day? Well. We had Big Sean and J. Cole came and they performed two songs each, which was really, really amazing. And then they like performed or they talked about like really inspiring things such as like being a good person and like charity and they also like yeah. And then there was Celine Gomez and Seth Rogen and like really cool people. Um, what do you think leadership the leadership class took away from We Day? Uh, definitely inspired us to keep doing our thing, like volunteering, giving money to free the children. It's like that's a big one, so very cool event. See that leadership is always working on new ways to make Miramani a better place. That concludes today's news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. Go, Go Mats! Mats!